Welcome back to Emily Victor. I just opened this ominous looking gate to this ominous looking place. Oh, I mean, this is an invitation, isn't it? Well, in fact, this is wood we don't need. This is an invitation we can just climb up a little more safely. Anything up here? Nope. Guess when I said it's not a uh, loot on rafters kind of mission, that still holds. Hello. This is. Certainly strange. Where is certainty? I mean, the grave, yes, true. It's rather a long way down, this guy might say. Well, here goes nothing. Oops. That, that oops voice line is so goofy. You kind of wish people wouldn't use it. Uh, snow? What the? Where? Let's where the hell are we? I mean, if this is hell, it's frozen over. Where the, where the North Pole are we? Oh, that's worth grabbing. Some of the snow must have melted. <laughs> what? Wasn't expecting that. This is the library again, isn't it? Oh. He's still there, but he's to the tailor, I think. transparent. has gotten so expensive. Worth it. Even the tradesmen are going up on the velvet coats. Hardly more than they used to. Hmm. <laughs> this window I don't think was there before. No, that's not the usual location. Is the secret passage there? So, what are you doing here? Uh, you want the truth? Since that is what you've come here to find, right? You enjoy sifting through filth? Then welcome, Mr. Garrett. Welcome to my home. Yet I will not be able to protect you. This is now my universe, but I do not have control over all its forces. Go, find the keys, and you will come close to finding out the reason why you have come here. To that end, proceed with caution, and watch out for any you might recognize. They only resemble those from the real world. They may be dangerous at times, but also may be of use to you, so treat them with care. Another important point, keep out of Anku's sight. Never forget that. One can never outwit death. One may trick it at times, but it is often death who turns the tables on us. You will see in his unlined visage many familiar faces. But don't let this faze you. You are the only one who is an outsider here. And for that reason, it is only natural that he is here too. Only he has the power to hold you here, forever, or to permit you to leave the world, leave for the world above. That is, if you are sufficiently cautious, and fast enough. Moreover, do not give in to fear. He can sense it. In hopes of never seeing you here again, good luck, Emily Victor. Well, the mechanist devices that haven't made it here. Hmm. What is 
this room. Oh, we're looking at passage in the fireplace. Okay. So, is that... Passage? No, okay, it's just... It's some equipment, okay. Is that a vine out of? Ah, well... Hmm... <laughs> maybe that's a problem. If we're gonna need a vine out of? And that's gonna stack to have repair, it's no longer a vine arrow. I hope that's not gonna be a problem. If not, I'm gonna have to reload a save and stick my rope arrows in the ceiling, pick up the vine arrow, and then pick up the rope arrows. Oh, well, who knew my throbbing harps would come in handy, right? I don't care if this is some fake other world banners. Banners are still evil. It's Maurice. With evil eyes stuck in a cage. There you go. Burn. Oh, I think you're where you belong, Maurice. Cage where you used to, where you kept rats. You're the rat now. Hmm. I don't even know where to go because well, that's all snowy. Sure, I can hear footsteps from both sides. There's another banner over there I have to deal with. Yeah, he's also semi transparent because he's not there. something there are two of them nothing there weird uh. hmm Does the entire place exists in whoops was my uh, mouse doing something funky Interruption there. And the windows noises. Everyone loves windows noises. Hello. But this is this is the ghost room. I just didn't recognize it. I thought this is a completely different room. Right. And one little glass of wine, low a little gussy chats. And two little glasses of wine, low a little gussy laughs. And three little glasses of wine, low a little gussy sings. And four little glasses of wine. Lower little Gus who dances. Five little glasses of wine. Lower little Gus who sleeps. The Joyful Frogs Chorus. Oh, 
another rip arrow, so... Hmm. Where was the... Uh... Oh, I mean, I can see behind this, there isn't, there isn't a uh, secret passage there, so I guess looking around for switches. It's not likely to be uh, productive. Early, uh, place of all the fireplace is gone, replaced with a barricade. Although, it does kind of look like there's a panel behind it anyway. Interesting. It's <laughs> definitely a panel behind it. You're too healthy. Probably best to leave you alone. I don't care if you're uh, going to be stuck on the desk, unable to reach me. Well, that's kind of interesting, isn't it? That's, uh, She sees the officers the spider's nest. Poor disappointed Louison. No one to enchant her. For her a gift, a tender word. May this flower never wither. And finally, with a smile, her sighs are extinguished. Joyful frogs chorus. Maybe I should be collecting these. Although what for? I don't know. I'm just gonna leave it. Alright, I think I'm going to leave that door alone. So I'm bothered now by the, uh, the panel, right? The fireplace panel is like... Where would the switch be to open? I mean, there may not be a switch in this world, I don't know, but I didn't find one in the other part either. And apart from psychological insights, I'm not sure what I'm going to get out of this, uh, this version of this area. Does it count as psychological insights when you're talking about a ghost? Do ghosts have a psyche, I guess? I mean... They seem to, right? They seem to have most personality aspects.
He comes back this way a lot. Yes. Okay, so one of these guys goes round and round, the other seems to go back and forth. That's gonna mean the timing is bad for me. Because I need to get up to the end of that hallway and into that other door. Well, I need to, I want to. I don't know, the other guy's coming now, so maybe that'll be alright. Making now. He's dead. I was warned not to harm them, but uh, worry, find you. that wasn't me harming them. Not it's not an objective not to, so I hope it doesn't do anything like make the mission unwinnable. I can still hear another frog. Metal floor in here. Body and a skeleton. Guess that's some kind of poetry, poetic rhyme in that. Yeah, that wood arrow was kind of wasted, wasn't that? So there are. Oh, that's not good. If they come in here, they're gonna see me I mean, if I'm lit up. And since they heard the explosions coming from here, they might come this way. I had been hoping the uh, door would uh, block enough sound. And look at that, someone's already cut that banner down. It's taking my job away from me. Well, I guess the good news about this guy being dead is he's no longer standing in front of the door to the office. Which means I'm going to be able to go and slash that other banner there. Ah, uh, you know, small, small wins. Is there anything else in here? Probably not, right? Probably it's just wasting broadheads. Just, just... <laughs> well, there seems to be moss arrows in the bath. As well as another skeleton, okay. Whoops, sorry mate, didn't mean to <laughs> climb in and disturb your bath there. No, I won't need the moss here, I don't think. Might put one by the door, it'll make it easier getting in and out quietly. If I need to be quick. Pretty 
Bearing in mind it's still quite bright in that room. Okay, well that seems to be happening up here. Oh, he saw the banners again. Hmm, I don't have a key for that, do I? Nope, don't have any keys right now. Did I go here already? Yes, yes, yes. I have not been out here yet. Guess things have changed a bit. I was going to say, does the whole house exist in this area? No. Well, maybe? Sound like guards patrolling now. Yeah, those aren't guards, are they? That's a guard. Still got his chamber pot on his head. It's kind of incredible, honestly. Oh, this doesn't connect on this side. Place to park a tree. Oh, forest bed is on fire. Seems unusual. Guards' toilets have no toilets anymore. Just a sink. So this place seems a lot nicer with all this uh, greenery around. I want to 
go around the other way. I don't really want to raise that front room yet. Seems I don't know what the upstairs is like. Although I don't really know what I'm doing in here. Steal the key to Laurie's carrying on his belt. Well, finally meet with Emily Victor. Well, yeah. I, I'm wondering, I don't have any sense of how to complete my objectives or even where to go. And I guess meet with Emily Victor. We're probably going in the right direction for it. Next bedroom is the one where I, I uh, began the night, so perhaps it is going to reveal. Oh, hello. Huh? Hello? Anyone there? Admiring himself in the mirror, huh? Flowers. It's a nice, nicely done illusion. I like, I like it. It's a little uh, limited, perhaps, but it's the engine's fault. It's very, very uh, nicely staged. Kitchens. Hmm. Do I want to read what that says? They're going to see me, aren't they? Maybe they're not going to care. Fireplace warms the body, but only a gift will warm the heart. Poor, disappointed Louisa. No one to enchant her. For her a gift, a tender word, made this flower never wither. Finally, with a smile, her sighs are extinguished. I can't believe he thought to charge so much for that. Does he think I'm a fool? Or I got this money by tossing it left and right to every scoundrel with his hand outstretched? An outrage. He won't see my business a second time. What, do I drop the flowers in here? Is someone there? Anyone there? Oh. Oh, that's a healing <laughs> potion. What? Oh, the air is getting so filthy. <sighs> hmm. What to do with the flowers, but this does not seem to be the place. You see anything this way? Someone move. Imagining things now. I thought I saw a corpse there. I was... important there we are just 
job done. Okay, I guess I do need to get upstairs then. But if he's going around anti clockwise, then I guess I should too. Oh, there aren't even guards here. The front door's gone, there's just two. Okay, I guess that's what's his name? what's his face. It is Louison who has the key. Yeah, but who is Louison? Yeah, do you drop? I get it. That's how I'm supposed to do it. Alright, thanks. Thanks for the key. Let's get around the long way again. Stay in the darker passages. So I don't know where Mr. Flames and Hopping Skull actually is then. Is he just doing counter circuits or what? Because like I thought I heard him when I first came in, right? Well, I definitely heard, heard him, but then didn't see any evidence of him after that <laughs> until I was here, and then I was just like, "Where did you come from?" Funny on that. Are you really gonna follow me around everywhere? Well, I guess that's okay. No, you're not gonna follow me everywhere, okay. I'm happy with that way slightly. Cute, but you're a little too cute. You're kind of slightly creepy. Wow, it's dead quiet in here. What a nice room. Are 
you are gonna follow me around, okay? At least there's no one running to and from the bathroom continually. Uh, looks like nothing. Still carrying the uh, toilet paper though, the roll of paper. <laughs> I love how there's light coming out of the toilet, that's pretty cool. This whole uh, other world's very, very neatly done. I'd like to go up there, but I want to kind of. Oh, hello, what's these masks? Oh, they're locks. Vague sense of the layout of this place. But, uh, guess I do mostly recognize where we are and where we've been, despite the changes. Oh, you know what? I wouldn't mind. Wouldn't mind those. Sorry, ma'am. Didn't mean to interrupt your bath. <laughs> The guard is still going to come in and come in here and peek in these places. Something's there. Well, seems clear. Did you see something over there? <sighs> Just rats again. They've got valuables. <laughs> Hey, doll. Someone <gasps> made a noise. Quiet. <coughs> That'll have to do, I think. I think I got, I think I did get all three. Come out here, man. So she got sp spooked enough at the door opening in order to start searching. Okay.
Is someone there? Let's see something, friend. The wind plays tricks on me today. <clears throat> I don't see any valuables in there, anyway. So. Well, that's just where I came from. Don't know why I was trying to put that out in the first place. Didst thou see that shadow move? Okay, now come all the way around. So let's go check out where Lady What's Her Name's chamber was. Up here. Quite normal. <laughs> How'd I get up there? I don't know, but it's uh, not here, I think. Looks like it'd be possible to reach out from there and grab that mask. So that's got to be one of the keys we need. This mask locks, I guess. How do we get there? I mean, who knows? That's that's. It doesn't seem that we get there from here, but who knows? I've been everywhere here and didn't find anything. Did I look up in here? No, I did not. There's nothing. Well, I think I'm going to get back downstairs. I think I've got more to explore outside. If outside is the right word for it. I thought these guys were closer than they really are. Okay, never mind then. <laughs> no. It was an accident, guys. One tiny misstep. Fight me, you coward. Nice hovering. Yeah, see there's nothing here. Nothing at all. Let's get back to your duties. So then, uh, what do I do now? Where do I go now? Back out the way I came in. Say hi to this fine fella. Hey, hey, fine fellow. Oh, he's, he's coming already.
This is the way I came in, right? Yes. Oh, there's that flame man. Are we following him? Maybe we're following him. No, maybe he's following me. This could be dangerous. I'm pretty sure I'm not like... Jumping at nothing. So that's why he didn't come back, he just wandered too far away. From my leash as it were. Do I need to steal his bone is the question. Pickpocket the bone from him? Or the skull? Well, I think if you stay near to Mr. Hellman, you'll find it's not so cold. Sure something? There. Oh. Just look for a dark corner to... To wait in for Mr. Hellman to come back. Okay, I may be able to uh, pick a pocket or something here. Like, no, no, we're gonna have to try. Okay, it doesn't seem to be a pickable pocket. That's where I came out. Ah. How do I get up there safely? Maybe I should put the torch out before climbing up there. They'll probably see me quite easily otherwise. Come on, Garrett. You can get off. Very loud, found secret. Okay, noisemakers. A couple of waters, a couple of mosses. You know, not bad. It's the waters I especially appreciate. I guess I've been using quite a few mosses as well. Hmm. Well, that whole 
warehouse if it is gone. Was there any other way for me to go in there? I don't remember. What's that? No oh, this is the theater. How do I can I can I get there? Oh, I came from there, didn't I? That's the kitchen. Oh, that's the kitchen door. Wait a minute. Do I just go back to the kitchen? Is that all I need to do? I definitely came from there. Maybe that's all I need to do, is go back to the kitchen. Okay, is he coming or going? He's going. Wait a minute. Go to the kitchen, it says kitchen's... Not the same place, is it? Right, I'm not getting out of those. I was very confused. There's two different kitchen doors. Okay. Thought I saw something. Nah, you imagined it, mate. It's just your imagination. Nothing there now. So then. Where am I going and what am I doing? The river is flowing, my ponies need shoeing. Oh, tra la la lally here down in wherever the hell this is. So I tried to open this right. Oh, I got a key. Oh, it's not the right one. Oh, I mean. Wait, I do have a bunch of keys. I don't know why I didn't find any before. One of the guards upstairs have the key to this? I don't think I saw either of them. Carrying a key? He isn't. Seem to be either. So then what? I mean, maybe I don't get in there. Wait, Maurice doesn't have the key, right? It's Maurice was hanging around in. Okay. Haven't left it by his bed. Okay. That's the library. There's nothing in here except that secret. Okay. Oh, he comes in here. I was not expecting to see him. Got a key. Exit key. Or maybe that's the exit. 
could barely see the key on his belt. It's uh, looked the same color as everything else. Uh huh. Right, well, they've seen me now. Attention, fragile. Delivery leaving to the world above. <laughs> the hell? Wait, did those, button, did those buttons take me to different places? Huh. Well, that, wasn't, that particular place wasn't very helpful to be in. If we go back to the grave, I mean, after all that, we don't—I don't feel very enlightened coming out of there. Just there. Wait, 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 I forgot where I'm going. I don't feel very enlightened after all that. I feel more confused than ever, really. Nothing's changed here, right? These guys are still still chatting away happily. Hmm. I guess we can still come in here. Guess we can still come in here. <laughs> I am quite confused. Exit's not far, right? I want to try that again. So I pressed two buttons because I didn't see an immediate reaction from the first one. Come on, door. Don't do this to me. I guess I can just press a button. Uh, press, like, first. Let's try that one. Top one. Nothing. Bottom one. Nothing. Far left. Nope. Far right. Nope. That one. So that's the one that's going to teleport me. Okay. It's the only one that does anything. Well, I am lost and confused. That was a very curious hour. 
wandering surreal corridors. Not very fruitful. Didn't really come away with anything uh, that I know what to do anything about. Didn't progress any uh, objectives. I'm kind of at a loss as to what to do next. Uh, so I'm going to end the episode here. And when I come back next time, I'll hopefully have some kind of an idea, some kind of clue. So I'll see you then.